Good afternoon, folks. I'm Jack Dutille. For those of you who don't know me, I'm the National Executive Director of your association, the United States Army Warrant Officers Association, and President of the Military Coalition that USAWOA is also a part of. Matter of fact, for the last week and a half or so, I've been busily, frantically working with my coalition partners to rifle through the thousands of pages in the House and Senate versions of the National Defense Authorization Act in the hopes that we will get an on-time budget or a close to on-time budget this fall in support of our national defense strategy. But I wanted to take a break and let you all know that this morning we went live with registration for our 48th annual meeting of the members this October. If you heard my birthday message and have been keeping up with your newsliner issues of the, issues of the newsliner magazine, you know that we had to make the difficult decision to do a virtual meeting this year instead of a face-to-face -face meeting uh, where we could all gather together for fellowship. But Folks, it's going to be a great show. It's going to be a fantastic show. In fact, I think it'll be the best Warrant Officer professional development opportunity you're going to have all year. I really believe that. We're going to hear from senior leaders, starting with our Chief of Staff of the Army, General James C. McConville, who will give the welcome address at the meeting. We'll also hear from our friends over at the Association of the United States Army, AUSA President, General Carter Ham, and our friend Lieutenant General McQuistian. And we really can't thank AUSA enough, I've got to get this plug in, for all the help they're giving us and offering their technology to us to really make this a flawless meeting. Um, we'll also hear from Major General McGee, the Army Talent Management Task Force Director who has generously offered to lead our Warrant Officer Talent Management Panel this year, on which will be many of your really influential and key senior Warrant Officer leaders that you're going to that you're going to be able to hear from. In addition to that, you'll also, of course, hear from your component level senior Warrant Officer leaders. That would be uh, Senior Warrant Officer Advisor to the Chief of Staff, CW5, Yolandria Dixon Carter, Army National Guard, CCWO, Teresa Domeyer, and Army Reserve, CCWO, CW5, Hal Griffin. On Friday, we'll even hear from Colonel Nelson, Colonel Ross Nelson, the Commandant of the Career College. All of these briefings and panels and professional development events will be interactive. You'll be able to ask questions of the briefers and panelists. And I think you'll get an awful lot out of it, an awful lot out of this meeting. And that, of course, is in addition to con conducting association business. And at the end of a couple of sessions, we're even going to have some virtual cocktail parties for fellowship and networking. So don't miss it, folks. It's going to be a great show. Go out on the USA WOA portal, you can look at the agenda, and in the Renewals and Online Store, which is a link on the portal, you can go in and register for the meeting. Whether you're a member of USA WOA or you haven't made that commitment yet, we want you to come register for the meeting. We don't want you to miss out on this great opportunity. So in the meantime, God bless and have a great rest of the week.